vlogged in a while. I've got new hair now. It's very me. It's very like ABBA. Um, I have wanted this hair for ages actually and hadn't actually had a professional haircut in a really really long time and then my friend Megan has amazing hair and she recommended someone to me um, and while it speaks for itself I'm obsessed with it it's a wolf cut and I am absolutely obsessed with it um, so anyways I thought I would get back into doing some more regular vlogs I haven't vlogged in ages Halloween is coming up at the end of this month um, and I really want to vlog that but also I actually do do quite a lot do do I actually do quite a lot of nice stuff on the weekends um, and today is a Thursday I'm at work work from home most of the time but I have to go into town later and then I've got a couple weekend plans so I just thought you know why not come along I want to give you an updated house tour as well because I haven't done that in a while and say hi to the dogs haven't done that in a while either um and yeah let's just do it good morning bella bella's really not a morning dog you love going back to bed don't you whenever i get up in the morning you go straight back to bed yeah you coming out to say hi to everyone no milo's upstairs in bed with kira so bella's got this big bed to herself you good girl, look at her wee paws. You're such a good girl. You're so sweet. I love my wee Bella. But yeah, she's definitely a nighttime dog. Like, she'll be running around the place. Like, t <laughs> she runs around the place from like about, I don't know, five o'clock to midnight. Um, and then the rest of the day, she's sleepy. Isn't that right? We'll go to the park later. Yeah, you good girl. So, since I last spoke to you, I actually had this office area made. Um, I haven't obviously haven't tidied it for this tour, but um, you know we're just being real here. So the dog cage fits perfectly underneath, which is why I wanted to do this. So um, this is actually a piece of wood, like a kitchen countertop from IKEA. So you can see there, it was like seventy pounds, and then my dad came over and he installed like these things like some wood underneath so that it actually just floats because then that meant that the cage can fit underneath perfectly and then on this side then obviously my chair fits underneath perfectly so this is where I'm working from at the moment and I've got some nice decor up these are my daily reminders first things first chill okay <laughs> I love this one don't freak out get your shit together um, and then I've put up some stuff here it's kind of just a random mix of things that I had sitting around so I might get some new stuff for up there um I've got my boobies that's a Polaroid from Berlin and that's a Polaroid from Barcelona um although you can't tell it's Barcelona but it is and then Edie drew that that was whenever I first got my tattoos I put up this shelf and I did it really badly because look it's really hanging out from the wall you can't really tell too much on camera, but like I really did not do a very good job of that. But it's a very cute little shelf. No, because something I discovered recently, because dad's always just done all like the putting up of stuff for us, but like he's not, he doesn't come down here that often. Whenever I first moved in, he was down here like every day and was helping with so much stuff, but like he has a job. So I was like, can I please just borrow your drill? Like I have a few wee things I need to do. So he very reluctantly gave me his drill and was like, this is my favorite drill, Colette make sure you keep it safe do not break it it's my favorite drill you know that kind of thing he gave me the drill about the drill um i hate myself <laughs> anyways uh i so i drilled into the wall for the first time in my life about a month ago why was i asking my dad to do this my whole life it is the most fun thing ever i literally went through this phase it was a phase for about a day or two where i was like i want to drill holes in everything i was like oh what am i gonna drill a hole in next like it's so fun it feels so powerful i imagine it's like what it feels like to go to like one of those places where you get to like destroy the whole room or like axe throwing or something which i always said i don't think i'd be into that i'm not a very angry person Apparently I am into it. I am into drilling holes in the walls. So maybe my personality has changed. I'm just an angry girl now. Um, real talk though. This is not a good angle actually. Real talk is since I started my ADHD meds, I actually think I'm angrier. <laughs> 
like they've changed my life so much i actually feel like a completely different person i feel like really really like i've got my life together for the first time in ages and like i actually can focus and do things and have goals again and um really changed my life but i feel like they make me angrier like i'm just very easily agitated um then maybe that's just me maybe i'm just getting cranky in my old age of 28 so let's get back to the tour though so you've seen my office absolutely gorgeous and for a long time i was working at this kitchen table which wasn't good because it's not good for your pops journal and um, if you're new here you won't have seen this but i got this on facebook marketplace quite a few things in the house are from facebook marketplace and this is like someone's old conservatory furniture but it really, really like fits in with the kind of vibe, like my kind of vibe. And then I also got this on Facebook Marketplace, this mirror, mirror, mirror. <laughs> oh my gosh. I actually think that I'm one of the people who lives in Belfast that actually can say that like better than other people. Mirror, mirror. I don't know. I don't know actually how you say it. I need someone from a different country to explain. Anyways, yes, yeah, so I got this mirror <laughs> and um, I then bought like this off of, I think it's just Amazon or something for like £1.50, literally so cheap, and then put that around that. And then I got this on the Urban Outfitters sale, which again, I put that up myself, so much fun, but like the screws are so far out from the wall, but you know, it is what it is. Um, then I've got my little candlesticks from... These two are from Etsy and this one is from Typo. And then I've got my bar area. This is just really for parties. Like I don't actually touch this like on a normal day to day basis. Like, um, and then I've got some stuff here, some stickers and yeah, disco ball. So I've got quite a few new things on here. My sister bought me this for my birthday old record and then um Edie bought me this poster the alba poster and then i got this for free because pony hawk is like a queer club night in belfast so i got that poster for free and then there's some of Edie's art and there's more of Edie's art down there this is helen anderson's art um helen anderson's like my favorite vlogger so that's her art and that's her art um that's the wee cute polaroids i got done when i went to brighton in august and then there's a few other things i've got some polaroids from berlin um yeah i really really love this and then i've got this section ta-da some rupauls you know what this is actually worth a lot of money and i didn't even know it belongs to Edie. i'm just borrowing it but it's actually worth a lot of money so i need to keep that safe <laughs> And then this side of the room, I have fairy lights up now, so it's really, really cute. Um, the blanket's a mess. But yeah, I really, really just love this place now. I can't remember when I last vlogged, because I'm not even sure that I had that TV up there or anything. But um, this is what the place is looking like now. And then I've got some crystals and incense and things like that up here. But it's all really come together. Like, I really, really love my little house. Like, so, so much. So cute. Anyways, I am going to go to work now. I got lots to do. You're welcome for the house tour. Um, we'll see what we get up to for the rest of this vlog. I'm very excited to just be doing things and talking to you. And I need to learn my angles again. Children. Hello, baby one. Can I pick you up? Wow. You wanna say hi to everybody? Uh oh. You're stuck in my jump room. Do I say hi to everybody? <gasps> He's a good boy. I'm just home from work. It's seven o'clock. I'm gonna make some food. I'm surviving on coffee and Pepsi Max and Adderall right now, which isn't really a vibe. Um Are you not happy I put you up here? Are you alright? No. I don't think he's in a cuddly mood right now. Milo has these different moods that he goes through and right now I think he wants to relax and be left alone. Do you want me to put you down, pet? You want me to put you down? Oh, what's wrong with you, baby boy? Hmm? We cheer you up? Do you want me to cheer you up? 
say woo -woo. There's nothing wrong with you. I knew you were faking. <gasps> Do you feel better now? You didn't want picked up. No, you didn't want picked up. You're a good boy. <laughs> Would you like something nice to eat? <laughs> I'll, get, I'll get you a wee treat. Um, so I did a shop on the way home from work, which is why I'm home quite late. I got some avocados. This is my drills drill and stuff um some tofu and oh i got some sauerkraut which i am obsessed with this like i love it so much um eggs are not mine i'm vegan they're my sisters um yes yeah, kind of you can see what i bought like i didn't really buy very much but you want your treats don't you pet you're blocking the camera Bella. you always put your butt hole in the camera Milo, do you have one? Bella, stop showing off your bum. <laughs> okay, last one. Good job, dogs. No, was that tasty? <gasps> was that tasty? What do you think? Who's in this? Who's the camera? I'll give you one more treat if you sing me a song. Say something. <gasps> Say something good. Sing me a song. <gasps> that wasn't really a howl. I want a proper song. Sing for your supper, Milo. <gasps> Whoa, that was good. You're good boy. Do you want more of these? <gasps> yeah, yeah. Look how cute you are. <laughs> ah, ha, 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 ha. That was sore. <laughs> right. Saturday now I had the busiest day at work ever yesterday and then I think it's a full moon right now and I mean I was angry I don't know like really angry I was really angry last night <laughs> I don't know what it is I actually think that um I think I used to instead of because I always said oh I'm not the type of person who gets angry every time like something would annoy me in my life previously I would get like emotional um like I would get upset about it and I would really like internalize it and like think it was my issue and all this stuff and I think since I've got more confident like I actually get angry now about things a lot more which is kind of good but last night I was just like I was just like ugh. I felt feral like I felt like a werewolf because of the full moon and because um I don't know day one of period anger I had anger issues anyways I'm not angry today although my tone of voice would suggest otherwise <laughs> I kind of sound a bit like riled up, but I got all dressed up. Um, I'm loving my hair because it's like ABBA themed, but I also put like an ABBA outfit on today. So I've got this little crop top I got on Vinted. It's actually the ASOS Francesca Perks. If you don't follow Francesca Perks, <gasps> I love her. She's like one of my favorite influencers. Um, and this is like a collab that she did with ASOS and it was quite expensive actually. And also I try not to buy stuff like um, on ASOS or like first hand unless it's like basic stuff that I really need. Um, and then I found it on Vinted. And then this wee scarf is from Vinted as well. And that's my outfit for the day. And I have really cool sunglasses as well. Let me get them. These are filthy actually. I don't think I can wear these ones, they're filthy. I got both these sets of glasses in Brighton, in the lanes, like they have loads of glasses. I'm sure you can buy them online as well though, but people always ask me where I get them, got them from, and they're from Brighton. I really need to clean these ones though. I don't know which ones to wear. I mean, they're both iconic. I just 
don't know what type of iconic I want to be today. Do you know what I mean? Anyways, we're going to have a good day. My friend Emma is picking me up. You haven't met Emma before unless you follow me on Instagram and then you've probably seen her in some of my Insta stories. But um, she drives, which is really exciting because I don't really have any friends that drive. Edie drives, but Edie's in Brighton. Um, I think that's it. Out of all my friends, none of us drive. You know that, like... Emma's, Emma and Edie are the exclusion to this, but you know what they say, you can't, you can't be hot and know how to drive, like you can't do both. Although, I've just booked my driving test, so, ah, I haven't even told anyone that yet. Um, yeah, it's like next year, and I haven't even done any lessons yet, but I booked the test. Um, so that's gonna be exciting, I'm gonna be able to drive, so I'm also gonna join the club of Edie and Emma and be the exclusion to the rule. Um, but yeah, we're going out now. I'm going to take you with me. I don't know what we're going to get up to, but we're going to get food and just have fun. Oh, it's so nice to be able to see my tattoos, actually, because it's been such cold weather and I've been wearing long sleeves. Like, I am going to put a coat on so you won't be able to see these, but... Ah! I don't think I showed you those on YouTube, actually. I have nine tattoos now, but um, I got this one on my... The, like, the day after my birthday. So, on my birthday, I went to Brighton. I didn't vlog it. But I was in Brighton for about 10 days and we went to London and seen the ABBA show. So this is like to symbolize, like it's like a 70s disco fairy and under a like ABBA disco ball. And then I got this one like in Belfast. It's a gramophone and I love it too. Those are my two favorites actually, but I have no plans for any more. I don't know if I will, I don't know if I will get any more. Like I haven't decided, but um i loved all my really small ones but then whenever i was like looking at them i was like it looks really strange just having lots of small ones so i was so happy that i got that one and that one like i really just feel like it made me feel like complete like i was like oh i was like these are beautiful these are like actual art and they're both custom as well so like they just feel like really really me like i love them but anyways i'm chatting so much let's go let's go get in the car i'm just gonna be here any second i need to down my cup of tea um Don't know why I'm doing this. Let's go, girls! Dun, 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 dun. That is so cute. I actually have a wee coffee machine too, like, so get a wee. But this one's for. Oh, do you like being in vlogs? <laughs> you look really cute today, though. This is Emma. Emma's outfit of the day. <laughs> so awkward. You're not awkward. <laughs> That's the pigeon's house. Hello, so we've arrived in Hollywood now. Um, if you're not from Northern Ireland, Hollywood's uh, like just outside of Belfast and it's on the beach. Um, and basically what we're doing is we're just going around charity shops and we're gonna get some food and stuff. So we've been into a couple charity shops already. I got so many sunglasses, three more pairs of sunglasses. Actually though, two of them are for Halloween. This is Hollywood. It's kind of a very overcast day. So you can see there's the big Oxfam. We just came out of there. And Emma's in here at the moment, cancer research. And it's very cute. It's basically just like this one long road. It's not a very big town, but it's really, really pretty. Follow us on Instagram. This one looks, oh, oh look at all the Halloween stuff. It's for your boobs, I think, is it? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna wanna buy everything. Oh, they're little squash. Oh my gosh, I'm upset. You can make soup with them. The pumpkin is huge, 10 pound pumpkin. This place is so cute. They have little, oh, they have stew. It's very Hollywood vibes, isn't it? It's very fancy. It smells amazing in here. All the dates, the figs, passion fruits. Mm. Is this your new favorite shop in the whole world? Do you remember what it's called? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my God. 
is everything. They must be all locally made. <gasps> Vegan pesto. That would be class. The solstice. Wow. Too much traffic. <laughs> so we're gonna go into here into the nutmeg and then we've got another charity shop and then there's two more here and um, oh there's another one as well. So there's actually loads. <gasps> nutmeg. So this is quite new. Oh, I love it. It's so cool. I love these. They're so good. I've never had those before. They're really good. Wow. So this is the menu. So we've got a few different options. And then all of these things. I think everything's definitely 100% vegetarian. Oh, it's actually all, it says it's all plant-based, so it's all 100% vegan, actually. Cool. Like on oh, that, that's good here. <laughs> Hello. So, we're in the nutmeg now. It's actually so amazing, because I didn't actually know what it looked like at all, because um, I've just seen it on Instagram. But um, I've ordered corn, everything's vegan. I've ordered corn chowder and this, like, pastrami sandwich. Because I actually haven't been out for food in ages. Like, not since, like, last weekend. So, <laughs> um, you ordered the same, didn't you? I got the But not the soup. Tea. You can taste the soup. Yeah, although I should really eat bread, but... Are you gluten yeah. intolerant? I think so. Not that close. Oh, well. <laughs> it's a first. Saturday. We'll see. <laughs> but it's so cute in here. Hello, we are just walking down to Helen's Bay. It's actually really nice weather. It's like the, what's the date today? The 9th, I think? The 8th or the 9th? 8th of October. And it, the sun is shining. It's golden hour as well. It's like um, 10 past five or so. Actually, I can't tell if it's golden hour. Everything looks golden through these sunglasses. <laughs> so I can't tell. I don't know if I've ever actually vlogged down here before because I haven't really vlogged this year. <laughs> Girlies. <laughs> Sunday. Um, I am going to the pub now. I'm going to the Sunflower. There is a flea market on and it's absolutely pouring with rain so I don't know whether or not I should take you with me. It's kind of rude if I don't, isn't it? Because I've just told you about it and then you're going to get FOMO. Mm. Okay, I'll bring you with me but I'm not going to vlog very much because I really want to just like chill and I want to have a few pints. And I might buy some stuff. I really shouldn't buy anything. You know what? You know what's not funny about me? Is I work full time. I work all day. I work all night to pay the bills I have to pay. But I never have any money left at the end of the month. I don't only just not have any money left at the end of the month. I dip into my savings. So the savings are basically disappeared. There's really very, very little savings left. So I'm going to have to kind of reassess the way that I live my life or else I'm going to have to get a promotion or I'm going to have to get a sugar mummy or a sugar daddy. Um, but not today. Today I'm going to the flea market and I saw online that there's loads of cute stuff there. There's like jewellery. There's It's supporting local, okay? Everyone's going through hard times and I just need to support local. Can you hear my sister hoovering? As long as you can still hear me. Um, but anyways, I'm very excited. Emma's actually coming again. So I saw Emma yesterday, I'm seeing Emma today. Um, and she's picking me up soon because it's raining and I was gonna get the bus, but beep beep, she drives. So yes, 
Anyways, I'm going to show you my app for the day. I got this on Vinted. Um, on the girl on Vinted, it was really like oversized and cool. On me, it's like a fitted crop top. But it is what it is. You know what? It is what it is. So, this chair's in the way, isn't it? Is this chair in the way? I can't see. I can't see. So this is what I'm wearing. <laughs> um, yeah, I've got long green skirt. I'm gonna put my docks on. I've got my new ring I got yesterday. Um, so yeah, let's go. Let's go. This lighting is terrible. Look, I actually look decent. I promise. Look, in the good lighting, I look decent. I've got green eyeshadow on today as well. Like I said, I'm just all in green for the suffix. <laughs> Share this video so it gets 100,000 views and then that'll pay for my weekend. Wouldn't that be ideal? Like if I took you out to fun places and spent loads of money but then made the money back through the videos, then it would be fine and then I wouldn't be in the dilemma of having no money. I've got it all figured out. We're manifesting that, okay? Share this video. Subscribe. Thank you. We are out in the sunflower flea market. I'm so glad that I took you with me because look how cool it is. And I've just spotted friends over there. Hello again, Emma. Hello. <laughs> oh, I have a couple Elvises at home, actually. Yeah. Elvises. Elvises. <laughs> oh, there's loads of singles in here. Um, and look at this. There was another one in here, actually, that was really cool, like that. There.